I want to speak to people um, that had childhood sexual abuse. I wanted to make a short, but it's too much meat in this potato. So I decided to do a very brief video. If you were sexually abused as a child, especially if your abuser took your virginity, um, and I want to speak to the people that uh, was uh, sexual harassed, like in a group, never feel that you are the only person, especially if you was a child, never feel that you were the only person this happened to. Abusers don't only uh, victimize one person in the family. Uh, they victimize multiple people. And just because at one point you told your story and nobody believed you, um, you know, the other victims have, uh, they're probably scared to come out. They didn't deal with it yet. They want to keep the secret. But eventually, we all are going to need healing and we all heal at different time. So just because it bothered you and you share your story, you was upset or whatever, you may have been the first in line to share your story. Just know that there's other victims um, behind you. This is why it's imperative for you to share your story. I'm speaking to all um, people that got abused sexually. Tell your story. Do not be quiet about it. Tell your story because you don't know the other people that were affected by that abuser. Again, you think you're the only one. Well, um, I've just, I just want to share my story. I was sexually abused. Um, the abuser took my virginity and everything and um 57 sorry 59 now and guess what the other victim just told me yesterday but i already knew that that person was a victim and multiple other people were victims but i was the first one to speak up and i just want to say you might be the sore thumb the one speaking out but trust me one day because you sh shared your story someone else will come to you and confess that it happened to them but you already know you know and it's just a good feeling to know that um the other victims that were involved is coming to you to share um their story and now the cycle is cut right so now the other victims are speaking out and then the other ones are coming out the other ones are coming out and then you guys can just collectively heal and then you will know that you weren't the big mouth one you weren't the troublemaker um my god you know i just i want to pray for all the victims of sexual abuse it wasn't your fault the person you didn't do anything to trigger this person the person probably got abused themselves it's a cycle guys so some victims decide that they will never do this they will never ever do that to anyone because they know how it feel but some victim decide to continue the cycle of abuse like to abuse somebody else because they are mad because they got abused themselves but man it's not easy and it's something that um, even though you put it in the back of your mind every now and then it comes up you also can see somebody else sometimes that is a victim but you don't say anything but you, you, you know them based on um, just triggers they're triggering you <laughs> for some reason and you see their behavior because that used to be you so basically um, I'm just going to wrap up this video you got to forgive yourself. You got to forgive the person. Yes, it's hard. The person that you're forgiven is for you to let that anger go, for you to let go and start the healing process, guys. Heal, heal, heal your trauma. Move on because if you don't, you're going to be miserable for the rest of your life. You're going to carry that pain and that hurt for the rest of your life. Basically, bury that little boy and that little girl or that little girl. Bury that. Bury those emotions. Bury it. You know what I mean? Forgive yourself, love on yourself, heal, tap, 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 um, hug a tree, walk barefooted, get therapy, there's nothing wrong with getting therapy, guys, talk it out, share your story, tell your testimony, um, and share your story down in the comment box, I just really wanted to do this video for all my people that have been sexually abused, I also want to say uh, to the uh, abusers, um, sometimes they're just so hurt guys I, I can understand now because I'm on the outside looking in but sometimes 
they're just so damaged. Um, this has, you know, like hurt people, hurt people, people say. But um, sometimes they just want to carry the cycle on because they think it's normal. But also, abusers, you need to get help as well. Again, it's a cycle. If not, you're going to carry this through. Stop, 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 stop what you're doing. Get help. It's never too late. Anybody could be delivered in the name of Jesus. And again, I'm just praying for all the victims. I'm also praying for the abuser. Sometimes when somebody do you something, um, you feel like you could never forgive them. You hate them, all this stuff. But you're just carrying those emotions with you. Forgive, move on, and be free. Free as a bird. Okay? Show your story.